What's going on YouTube? Coming to you with another recipe video. This is going to be a homemade Chipotle burrito bowl. I know Chipotle seems to be the hot thing now. Everyone goes there to get burritos and burrito bowls, but this is just the easier way to make it at home for a lot cheaper using very similar ingredients. I actually just cooked up some cilantro lime rice, which is what they use. Throw white rice or brown rice in a rice cooker, chop up some cilantro. You can use low sodium chicken stock and then add in some lime and that cilantro lime rice and then I'll show you the rest of it. So let's get started. Oh, and Brittany just went to uh, heat up a tortilla shell and put it on a plate that shouldn't be in the microwave. <laughs> and this is what it came out to be. A burrito bowl. All right, so now what I'm doing here is just weighing out the ingredients one by one and using six different bowls. This is for production value. If you're doing this at home, I recommend using one bowl because cleaning all this up is a bitch. So you can just go ahead and put one big bowl on the scale and just add the ingredients one by one. All right, so I just weighed out all of the ingredients. As always, I will let you know the ingredients and the macronutrients both at the end of the video and in the description box below. But now all we do is just add it to the bowl and that's the burrito bowl. So we have one cup of cooked white jasmine rice. You can use any rice you'd like. And like I said, I made it cilantro lime in the rice cooker. Six ounces cooked of grilled chicken breast. One serving of corn salsa or any salsa that you like. A half a serving of black beans, which comes out to about 65 grams. One serving, two tablespoons or 32 grams of fat-free sour cream and one serving of already made guacamole. You can also make regular guacamole using avocado, but this is just easier and more convenient. So that's the whole recipe, Chipotle burrito bowl. All information is in the description box below. Hopefully you enjoyed it and tried it out. Let me know if you do and what you think of it. Don't forget to like the video or give it a thumbs up. That really helps this channel grow and get my name out there to get seen by other people. So I appreciate your support as always, and until next time, I'll see you in the next video.